What's up guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to remove the black bars from your YouTube videos using Filmora. The reason why you are seeing black bars on your YouTube video is because of the aspect ratio. The aspect ratio refers to the shape of your video. Aspect ratios can come in different shapes ranging from 4x3 to 2.39x1. The most common aspect ratio you will see is 16x9. 16 by 9 also happens to be the aspect ratio that YouTube uses for its video player. If a video isn't in a 16 by 9 aspect ratio, then you will end up seeing either vertical or horizontal black bars on a YouTube video. If you want to avoid having black bars on your YouTube videos in the future, then the best option is to use a camera that captures footage in a 16 by 9 aspect ratio. If you can't get a camera that films in that aspect ratio, then you can use one of these three options to avoid having the black bars on your YouTube video. So the first step you want to do is go ahead and download Filmora. You can find it at filmora.wondershare.com. Instead of having black bars, you can just duplicate the same video clip, crop it so it fills the background, and add a blur to it. You will need to drop one video clip on the primary track and then go ahead and drag and drop the same clip on the picture in picture track. Now select the video clip on the main video track and then click on the crop and pan tool which can be found in the timeline tools. Now you want to make sure the 16 by 9 crop is selected. Now drag the crop so that the video fills the entire screen on the right. Then you can hit OK and it will update in the timeline. Now you want to apply a blur to the same video clip by using the power tool in the timeline tools. Turn on the tilt shift option by clicking on the little gray box. You can then grab one of the yellow lines for the tilt shift border and decrease the size by dragging inwards. Now reposition the tilt shift either as far left or as far right that you can drag it. Now click OK and it will update in the timeline. You can go ahead and export your video now in a 16 by 9 resolution and now you won't see any black bars on your YouTube video. The second technique is similar to the blurred background, but instead, you could use a different background that represents you or your brand. As an example, I have a Filmora background in my media library that I can use. I can drag and drop that on my primary track. Then I will drag and drop my video clip on the picture in picture track. Now you can export your video in a 16 by 9 friendly resolution and there won't be any black bars on your YouTube video. If you don't want to use the first two options, then the last possible option you have is to use a 16x9 crop on your video clip. This will result in losing parts of your footage that won't be seen anymore, and you might lose picture quality in your footage depending on its resolution. But you won't see the black bars when you upload it to YouTube. You can do this by dragging and dropping your footage into the primary track and then go ahead and click on the crop and pan tool in the timeline tools. Now you want to make sure the 16 by 9 crop is selected. Then you can go ahead and reposition the crop. Now hit OK and the crop will be applied in the timeline. Go ahead and export your video and select a 16 by 9 friendly resolution and you will have a video that no longer has black bars when you upload it to YouTube. So there is good news for the future. YouTube plans on making their mobile app have dynamic aspect ratios so that the YouTube video player will change size to fit different types of aspect ratios. Until then, you will need to use one of these three techniques to remove the black bars on your YouTube video.